Hi, I'm Rose and welcome to Precision Machining. I am a student from Cloverleaf, but I take all my classes here at the Career Center, one of them being this lab, the other being normal academic classes like honors or even college classes like digital electronics where we learn basic circuitry. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna take a trip over here to our CNC mill. Our CNC mill is one of our computed numerical control machines. This is a vertical machine, so it machines up and down. So what Johnny is running over here is one of our inspection parts. So he's milling it to correct specifications and the diameters that we need for the whole setter in that part. So with our CNC machines, we hand write the program for them. They read the program and they run the part for us. So we're gonna come over here to our manual lathe. Our manual machines are hands-on, so we are doing them by ourselves rather than watching programs. So you can see Zach facing off and turning our part right here, getting it to the correct length and the correct diameters for the specifications that we need for the part. In addition to being part of this lab here at the Career Center, we are also able to stay involved in activities at our home schools, so sports clubs, stuff after school like that. So I am involved in Color Guard, which is a part of our marching band. So I go back to Cloverleaf after I'm done here at the Career Center and I'm a part of that. So over here we have Corey working on our manual mill. Manual mills are, again, manual, but they're also vertical machines, so they have three axes, so they can machine straight up and down, side to side, and back and forwards. So what he's doing right now is he's facing off his piece the, the correct length using the different dials and digital readout so he knows exactly the length he needs to go to for that part. Over here we have our CNC lathe that Johnny is running. So our lathe is another horizontal machine specifically turning. What we do for this, we also create a program for it. We upload that program to the controller and the controller feeds it into the machine so the machine knows exactly what it needs to do rather than us having to turn the handles manually. With the CNC lathe, I am actually competing in CNC turning for Skills USA coming up. So what I will do is I'll handwrite the program for this machine, they'll proof it, and they'll critique it based on their specifications that they want for the part. And next we're gonna move on to our measuring room. Over here we have our measuring room. This machine right here is called an optical comparator. So we can find the measures of diameters, angles, lengths, anything like that. Over here we have our coordinate measuring machine. So it uses different types of coordinates to get the measurements that we need off of a part. Um, we have a hardness tester to test the hardness of the material we are working with in our lab. And we have a wire EDM machine. There are many different opportunities for employment with our lab. During our summer from junior to senior year, we can get a summer internship so we can work over the summer. And we also have the opportunity for early placement. So early placement is when you leave to work during the school day. So you would take your academic classes in the morning, but when it's time for lab, you would go to work instead. So I work at a place called FIT, Fuserashi International Technology, where I make parts for Honda, specifically CVT lock nuts, so I'm running their CNCs over there. Thank you for joining us on our tour and we hope to see you next year.